Lord would bless. word of prayer. We do want to say that if you're able to, um, if you're able to, you can go to the Zoom chat and place your prayer request within the Zoom chat. Um, if you're in another medium and you'd like to uh, send us, go to the Facebook page and place um, your prayer request there. We'll get your prayer requests as well there. Um, we're going to touch and agree with you because we want 2024 to be greater than 2020. It's like never before. We said to the church, we want 2024 to be the Lord bless us even the more. We want God to move like he's never moved for the people God uh, wants you to. And that's talking about healing. That's talking about uh, uh, finance. It's talking about a spiritual work and a spiritual walk with God. Uh, some of you are yearning to get in a place with God to do God's will and to fulfill his purpose. Some of us want to be restored. Some of us want to go higher. Some of us uh, want to have that this special relationship with God. We're praying for a revival, a crusade uh, that will save thousands, that will reach thousands. You know, God needs his people. We're praying also for the people that are in the Gaza Strip, for people that are in Israel people that are in Ukraine, uh, people are, that are uh, suffering much war. So Prophetess Lucas is going to lead us in prayer. Amen. And uh, we thank God so much for Prophetess Lucas. Amen. Please feel free uh, to move forward. God bless you. Praise the Lord, everybody. Praise Father the Lord. God, we come to you giving you all glory all honor praise. Thank you, O oh God, for allowing us to assemble ourselves once again in your holy presence. We thank you, O oh God, for how you watched over and kept us all year long. We ask, O oh God, that you forgive us of our every sin, shortcoming, and wrongdoing. We ask, O oh God, that you will answer our prayer and hear our cry, O oh God, on tonight as we go into this new year. Ask you, O oh God, to bless the service, O oh God, on tonight. Remember, O oh God, each and every one, O oh God, I pray. Ask you, O oh God, to remember those, O oh God, who has a prayer request, O oh God, before you. Yes. We touching and agreeing, O oh God, that you would grant, O oh God, that prayer request on tonight. O oh, oh God, you know and see what they're standing in need of, O oh God. And we trust and believe that you would answer their prayer. O oh God, ask you, O oh God, that you will move for them in the mighty name of Jesus. O oh God, ask you, let this new year, O oh God, be a better year for somebody, O oh God. A different year, O oh God. A blessed year, O oh God, we pray. For your people, God, let this year be filled, O oh God, with your Holy Spirit, O oh God. Fill, fill with your peace, fill with your love, joy, and happiness, O oh God, in the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus, O oh God, remember our leaders, O oh God, continue, O oh God, to keep them, be with them, O oh God. for the ministry. We thank you, oh God, how you're moving, how you're blessing. We thank you, oh God, for what you're doing for your people, oh God. Oh God, this year and going into the new year, oh God. Just thank you, oh God, for doing tonight. Thank you for what you're doing and for what you're going to do. Oh God, in this new year, oh God, looking for great expectation, looking for more, oh God, looking to go higher, Oh God in you, oh God. Remember of us and our family and loved ones. In the mighty name of Jesus. Oh God, we praise you, we magnify you, we thank you and give you all the glory, honor and praise. In the name of Jesus. Amen. 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 We thank God for Prophet Lucas and prayer. Amen. And we uh, are so blessed 
as we go into this new year. Uh, in the house of prayer or uh, in worship and in prayer, uh, our form is a Um, we were we had a church the walls the church was a large edifice and it sold that it was uh auditorium style so you could walk up the aisles you can walk in the back you can walk Praying and asking God to direct us. Look, it's important to have prayer uh, in your lives. Yeah. Prayer is so important as we move into this new year. Don't start this new year without asking God to do something and give you direction. Yeah, Amen. Know. Praise God. God, and after which we're going to have a testimony from Jeanette, Evangelist Jeanette Blackwell. Yeah. Uh, afterwards, we're going to have a testimony from Evangelist Praise, Praise the Lord. Lord. Truly, it's a blessing to be with the um, Holy Temple East on tonight, this blessed New Year's Eve night. God has blessed, blessed me so much on 2023. Yeah. And I'm going to give the testimony about my education. Beautiful. And I remember when um, I was going to school. And my math was kind of rough for me, and I would call overseer, um, Pastor Shelly, and I would tell her, I'm giving up on school because the math is too hard for me. And she began to pray with me and pray for me. And I passed the math class and wound up coming out yeah. copping a 3.6 GPA. Yeah, and I have honor, honor from them. And now 
I'm getting my master in school counseling, and I'm also yeah. on a student there. I'm current right now a, a 3.5 GPA, and God is truly blessing me through my education, through the prayers from my overseer and from my apostle, and in the encouragement of my husband. Yes. And I also like to say in 2023, we had um, two graduates, one from high school, and she graduated with honor. Yes. And my oldest daughter, she's going to school to be a registered nurse, and she graduated with her AA degree, and she also received honor. And I think they with one another and see who's going to get the best grade. And I just thank God for that. And I thank God for the encouragement of my husband, how he encouraged me to go to school. And I never thought that I'll have the college degree to have two. Now I'm working on my third one. And I thank God for that. And I thank God for how good this year I, um, I was uh, working for a contract for Baltimore City Public School. Yes. And now I'm working as a have a permanent position, and also with that permanent position, I have another little part time job through the city where I help tutor the kids and read. Mm -hmm. And I just thank God for how He has blessed me down to 2023. Amen. Amen. Awesome testimony. We are just so thankful how God has blessed Evangelist Blackwell, that testimony. Look, it's never too late. It's yeah. never too late for you to uh, embark on an education, embark on a career, embark on an endeavor. When God speaks to you to do something, go ahead and do it. God will be with you. You heard Evangelist Blackwell talk about how she struggled in the area of math, but she called and asked for prayer. She got support from her leaders. She had support from her church. She had support from her husband. And with support, you can do it. You know, yes. The Bible says, I can do all things, all things through Christ that strengthens me. So that's an, a testimony to encourage you if you are thinking about going back to school, if you're thinking about going to school, uh, there is no age limit that should deter you. Um, God is able to do exceedingly abundantly above which we ask or yeah, even okay. think. So we praise God again. Isn't the Lord good? Yes, he yes. is. Amen, he's good. All Amen, time. it's time for prayer once again. Praise the Lord. Our broadcast is going to be full of prayer, uh, and we and prayer is so important. Our evangelist, Sheena Beckford, is going to lead us in a word of prayer. God, we just thank you for all, God, that you're doing for us. God, we thank you how you allow us to make it to the end of the year. God, we thank you, oh God, how you blessed each and every one of us on this year. We thank you, God, all for all the doors, God, that you've opened. We thank you for all the ways, oh God, that you've made for us, how you've kept us. Leading us, oh God, how you yet opening doors and making ways for us. How you yet shielding us from danger seen and unseen. God, we thank you for just being God thank in you. our lives. God, we thank you for salvation. We thank you for the gift of the Holy Ghost. 
We thank you, oh God, for sending your Christ, your son, Jesus Christ of Nazareth, to die for our sins. God, we just give you glory, honor, and praise. God, we thank you for our leaders on tonight. God, we thank you for Apostle and Dr. Shelley on tonight. We thank you for their life living. We thank you for their staying. Oh God, we thank you, oh God, for their faithfulness, their dedication unto the ministry. God, we thank you, oh God, for their example. God, we pray that you continue to encourage them. God, continue to and hold them up, oh God, in this upcoming new year. God, everything that they have set before you, God, we pray, God, that you would grant their prayer requests and their petition, God. We pray that you would drink them in your anointing. God, remember the ministry, God, and everyone that's connected to the ministry, God, that you would move, oh God, on each and every family, oh God, represented, oh God, on tonight, on the line, God, even in the church, oh God, that you would just pour out your spirit. God, give us more of you, God, and love to the things of this world. Oh, God. God, help us to turn unto you, oh God, that you would turn unto us. God, I pray, God, that you would feel, God, some of a refreshing, God, of your Holy Ghost. God, I pray, God, that you would just pour out your spirit, oh God. Heal troubled minds and broken yes. hearts, oh God. In the name of Jesus, God, be with each and every one of our children, God, grandchildren, great-grandchildren. Come them in your blood, God, on this new year. As the new year, God, come in. God, we know some are going to leave God here. We know, God, you're going to take some, God, before the year is out. God, and we pray, God, that you will just continue to hold us up. God, continue Thank to strengthen us. Thank you. Thank you. Keep us, oh God. Awesome. Heal. God, the prayer on tonight. God, we pray, oh God, that you would move, God, on their behalf. God, whatever yeah. they have. For you on tonight, God, that you would just move. God, be yes. in the midst, oh God, for whatever they ask of you to do, oh God, that you would do it. Oh God, that you would heal for bodies, oh God, that you would deliver minds. God, that you would turn heart start towards you. Those who are backslidden, God, that may have fallen away, God, have mercy on them on tonight, God. I thank you, God, for this opportunity to pray, oh God. Thank you for those who are touching and agreeing on tonight. Oh God, that you would move, God, that you would answer, oh God, our prayer request. God, let this upcoming year be a blessed year, God, for your people, a prosperous year, people, God, full of signs of wonders, God, miracles, oh God, healing and deliverance. God, continue to keep us, God, in your perfect will. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen and amen. 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 Let everybody say amen. Amen. We seal the prayers of God by saying amen. Thank God for it. Amen. Our youth church pastor, uh, Evangelist Beckford. Amen. Beautiful. Yeah. And we thank God for you yielding your vessel. Amen. To pray uh, as we go into the new year yes. uh, that God would order our steps, that God would bless our families, God would bless our children, our grandchildren, yes. our great grandchildren. Yes. Amen. We thank God so much. Uh, we have a testimony that we're going to um, bring before you, Evangelist Bell. Amen. She has yes. a testimony. Praise the Lord. The uh, songwriter said, I believe I'll testify while I have a chance. Amen. Amen. So we thank God so much. I'm going to step away for a few minutes. Amen. While you hear. Um, this beautiful testimony coming from Evangelist uh, Deborah Bell. Bless you. Amen. Yes. Praise the Lord, everybody. Praise, Praise the Lord. Lord. So, um, one, I would like to thank God for my leaders, for my husband and family. Thank God. Um, I'm going to talk about um, my teaching journey. And my testimony is I was on a job where I was not getting treated right um things were happening to me unnecessarily and um i was in a position where my mind was basically um focused on you know how that person felt and um through my leaders and you know through them praying um i was able to um put in my resignation and i believe it was on uh, Christmas Day. Christmas Day, I put in my resignation about two years ago. And um, I started off, I, well, I put my application in um, for Baltimore City Public Schools, not knowing what was going to happen. I listen, you know, by me listening, I'm going through step by step. And in my mind, I said, okay, I don't know what's going to happen, but I'm just going to listen and I'm going to follow directions because I know I didn't follow directions before. But just to fast forward, um, I got a call, I want to say not even 
uh, now a couple of weeks later. And the Lord was able to um, allow me to go step by step in the Baltimore City Public School System, which means I started off as a um, day to day sub. And then I turned into a long-term sub, and then um, the following, the very next year, I was able to become a part educator, and the Lord blessed me where I am now in the teaching program, and I am now a full-time um, second-grade yeah. teacher for Baltimore City Public Schools. Yeah. Yeah. So that is basically my testimony, and I truly thank God for how 2023 has blessed me and my family, and um, pray my strength in the Lord. Yeah. Awesome. Amen. Two powerful testimonies. Um, both of them uh, uh, as some may know, the boy is my daughter, and uh, I, I remember when she finished school, she was 18 years of age, and I just knew this is what she was supposed to do is when you turn 18, you're supposed to go to college. And so I took her to college and had her sign up. And um, she went a couple of days, maybe a week. Then she decided she didn't want to do that. Uh, I want to encourage parents that there is no specific line in which uh, the kids are supposed to develop. Uh, you may think the child's supposed to be in, in, in college, but they may want to go into a different profession. Uh, they may want to be an electrician. They may want to be a carpenter. You ought to encourage your children to do what God uh, uh, has in their heart to do, what their passions are. And once she found her passion, that's when she went to school. She didn't go to school, I think, until her mid-30s uh, or exactly. early 30s, early 30s, uh, and uh, was able to finish uh, college by her mid-30s. And, yeah. or, or towards the end of 30s. And then now she's great in uh, the school system. So God is able uh, to do some things that are tremendous for us in, and in our behalf. We have uh, another song that we're going to ask Evangelist um, Shelly again, and she would come and bless us in song. After which we have prayer to be led by our assistant pastor, uh, Pamela Smith. God bless you. God bless you. Praise the Lord, everybody. Praise the Lord. No screen this time. <laughs> Sing it. Why should I find huh? this gallant? Who? And why should the shadow God, no. <laughs> Why should my heart feel lonely? <laughs> my portion. And I know he watches I see because I'm happy and I say because His eyes Sing it. the sparrow, oh, and I know he watches me. Amen. 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 Amen.
Please put your phone on mute. Please put it on mute because we can hear you when you're speaking. So we need you all to everyone. If you're not praying or giving a testimony, please put your phone on mute. Amen. And this time we're going to hear from our um, assistant pastor Smith. In prayer. Father, in the name of Jesus, God, we glorify you, we magnify you. Father, we thank you how we have assembled today, Father. Father, we thank you the last few hours left in the year of 2023. Father, the last few minutes, Lord, God, I pray in the name of Jesus, Lord. Remember everyone assembled here today, God. Father, remember every prayer petition, Lord. Father. Father, remember every family that is represented here today. Father, in Jesus' name, God, remember even every special petition, God. Father, I pray in the name of Jesus, Lord, go in every home on this year, God. Lord, allow the blessings of the Lord to shower your people in 2024. Father, God, allow doors to open, Lord. Father, send healings during 2024. Father, God, grant prayer petitions, Lord. Father, in the name of you, Lord, those with loved ones up before you, God, minister to them, Lord. God, move on their behalf, Lord. Tear down strongholds, Lord. God, that the enemy desire to build, God. Father, I pray, Lord, a blessed finances, Lord God. Father, in Jesus' name, Lord, bless on jobs, God. Father, bless in the school systems, Lord. Father, I pray in the name of Jesus, Lord, continue to shower your anointing, God. Touch, save, and set free, God. Father, deliver, Lord. Father, remember the backsliders. God, reclaim, God. Draw souls, Lord. Father, I pray in the name of Jesus. Remember those in the hospitals tonight, God. Grant miracles, God. Touch bodies, Lord. Heal someone, I pray tonight, God. Father, in the name of Jesus, Lord. Remember the to them, I pray, God. Yes, Father, And upon us, Lord, uh, upon our people, Lord, uh, remember our governments, Lord God, in your name, uh, leading God, I pray today, Lord, uh, Father, in the name of Jesus, I pray today, oh God, uh, remember your people, Lord God, uh, in the name of Jesus, Lord, uh, shield them, I pray, Lord God, uh, in the name of Jesus, Lord, uh, make a difference for your people and I, God, uh, keep them covered, Lord, uh, Hold them up, God. Grant them miracles, Lord God. Make ways easy for them, Lord God. Lamp favor to follow your people and I, God. Father, in the name of you, Lord God. Thank you, Lord God, for all that you've done, Gia, in 2023, Lord. Thank you, Lord God, how you granted us, Gia, seen and, through, seen and unseen dangers, Lord. How you protected us, Lord God. How you guided us, Lord God. Father, we thank you. I pray, Lord. Every prayer you answer, Lord God. Lord, we thank you tonight, God. And we lift you up. Want to give your name, Lord, which is holy to praise, Lord. All the glory and honor shall be done. Father, we thank you tonight. Father, we magnify you, Lord. Thank you for Apostle Overseer Shelley, Senior Pastor Bob, every elder, every evangelist, Lord. Lord, every participant on tonight, God. Down to the smallest child, God. Father, we praise you and magnify you, Lord. Father, continue to shower your blessing. 
on your people in a special way, Lord. And we give your name, which is holy to praise. And all the glory and the honor is thine. In the blessed name of Jesus, we pray. Thank God. Amen and amen. 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 We give God praise. We thank God for uh, Pastor Smith and uh, her prayers and how uh, she was praying for us as we go into this new year. Yes, Amen. The prayers of the righteous avail of much. Next, we have remarks uh, from Pastor Admiral. Um, <clears throat> Pastor Admiral, you will probably have to unmute your, your mic. Praise the Lord. But we're looking to hear from Pastor Admiral. She pastors uh, one of our sister churches in Darlington, South Carolina. Amen. And we thank God for the work that she's doing. Yes. Praise the Lord there. Uh, Pastor Admiral. So you probably have to unmute your mic. Hello, everyone. Can you hear me? Yes. yes. Praise the Lord. All praise to the living God. I just want to thank God for being here tonight. Yes. Amen. I want to thank God for all of you that joined in. Yes. It is yes. such a blessing for us to look back over the days and the months of this year. And we look forward to the next 15 minutes of entering into a new year. We want to thank God for all the prayers that went up and all the blessings that are showering down right now at this point. I want y'all to continue to, to be strong because the word for this year is power. power. It's power, it's unity, and it's more encouraging and motivation. So we got to have a lot of power to continue to move forward in this new year because this is a year of all challenges. So I just want to thank God for that. I want to thank God for y'all allowing me to speak and share that. So in the name of Jesus, we just want to thank you for that. Back to you now, Pastor. Bless you, Pastor Admiral. Yeah. God bless you. And that word on power. Amen. Amen. We're looking for the power of God to manifest itself like never before. The Bible says, except you see signs, and wonders you shall not believe. Amen. And we're looking for Amen. the power of God. We're looking for the power of God. We have with Amen. us our very own assistant, Pastor Smith. She prayed earlier, but she also has a word for the people of God. She is a steward. Uh, Pastor yes. Smith is a faithful worker in God. She is a theologian. She has knowledge of the word of God like none other. So, Pastor Smith, come on, give us a word yes. as we move into this new year. Amen. We give God glory, honor, and praise. We give honor to God. Give honor to our uh, chief apostle, Julia Williams, absent from body, present with the Lord. Give honor Amen. to her. Our chief apostle, Celia Blue, amen, going on to be with the Lord. Give honor to our apostle and overseer, Shelly, amen, tonight, Holy Temple East. Thank God for our senior pastor, Billums, Deacon Billums. Thank God so much for our pastor, Ed Mill, amen, from South Carolina, overseer, saying, thank God for all of the saints of God, missionary roulette. Thank God for everyone that's online, elder all the evangelists, everyone down to the smallest child. We praise God so much for coming at this season, coming into a new year. And we thank God for the word that the Lord has given our overseer Shelley from the month of April of 2023. And the word that the Lord gave her was in Psalms, the 12th chapter, help Lord. Help. And we thank God that from that time, even unto now, the Lord has continued in that word and that word has resonated. And it came times where each one of us at different times had to say, help, Lord. I praise God for how he blessed in 2023 Mother Robinson. I God. thank God that they had given her up, I would say, several months. Wow. 
maybe six months before she actually passed away. They gave me a phone call to come, and they said, call all the next they can and be here in the next few minutes. And I came over there, and they had expected her to expire at that time. But I thank God that prayer went up. I contacted uh, Apostle Overseer, all of the saints of God, Pastor Bell, Overseer, Saint Ben, all the prayers of the righteous Holy Temple East have gone up. And the Lord turned that around for Mother Robinson just that fast. I mean, from saying, call the next of kin, and when I got to the hospital, they were saying, wow, she has a miraculous turnaround. And she was actually released from the hospital after that point and lived almost another six months. Yeah. So I thank God so much that the prayers of the righteous avail as much. And I thank God for her, her life. She lived to be 95 years old. Yeah. She has always loved the Lord from even a child unto adulthood. So we praise God how he extended and blessed her life. And thank God again for each and every one of you looking for the great blessings of the Lord coming in 2024 and expect a miracle as our chief apostle Junior Williams used to always say. God bless you. Love everyone. Love and, you. and have a happy pre-new year. God bless you. Yes. In 2024, we want you to expect more. We thank God so much for Pastor Smith. Amen. That beautiful testimony. Uh, we thank God for her and her stand in God and those words. We salute you, all of you that have joined us today. Praise the Lord. This is going to be a great year for you. God is going to direct your path. God is going to bless you abundantly. Uh, We also are blessed to have in Miami our pastor, senior pastor Billums and Deacon Billums. Uh, They are a team. Praise the Lord, Pastor Billums, Deacon Billums. Praise the Lord in Miami. Yes. Amen. Looking forward to hearing. A word. Amen. Praise the Lord, everybody. Praise, Praise the, the Lord. Lord. <laughs> Can you all hear me? Yes. yes. Yes, we hear you. We hear you. God bless everyone. Bless Amen. you. Bless Merry you. Christmas to all. Praise the Lord. <laughs> Happy New Year. Happy New Year. It's about to come in to another new year. Yes. We honor the Lord. Praise the Lord. We give great honor to our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Praise the Lord be on our late chief apostle Julian Weem, Apostle Ocea Blue. Praise the Lord who is now absent from the body, but to be present with the Lord. Praise yes. the Lord be on praise the Lord, Apostle Ron Shelley. Bless praise you, the Lord, Lord Dr. Lord. Margaret Shelley. Praise <laughs> the Lord. Hallelujah. We just bless the name of Jesus. Thank God. Hallelujah for what the Lord has done and how God has brought us down through the years. Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. We bless him. Praise the Lord for all of his people on tonight. We honor Deacon Billum. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. We honor. Praise the Lord. Pastor Ed Mill. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Sister Pastor Smith. Praise the Lord to all of Holy Temple. Praise the Lord. This is what the Lord has already done. Truly, the Lord has done great and wonderful things. Amen. So we come to you tonight with the joy of the Lord. Amen. Praise in God. Hallelujah. Because God has been so good to us. Yeah. Praise the Lord. We just want to encourage, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. The saints of God. Praise the Lord. We know that. Praise the Lord. The Lord has given overseer. Praise the Lord. A word. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Help Lord. Help praise the Lord of God. Lord has helped many of us <laughs> down through this year, yes, 2023. Yes, yes, yes. Now we are about to approach another year, 2024. Another year. Yeah. Praise the Lord. Just want to leave with the thanks of the Lord. Praise the Lord to be and continue, continue to be steadfast. Steadfast. Continue to be steadfast. Yes. Knowing that your labor 
what you are doing for the Lord, it will not be in vain. For as much as ye know, it is not in vain. We honor, praise the Lord, apostle, praise the Lord, the work that the Lord has assigned unto their hands. Amen. And we just pray that God will surround them with much love and support. That they will be there to uphold their arms. Praise the Lord. So we thank God for who God is and what the Lord is doing. As that's the Admiral said, that we need power, power to go into this twenty twenty four year yeah. that we are about to approach. Praise the Lord. But we bless God. We know that God has all power. Praise the Lord, and He has given us. The ability to do that he has called us to do. Yeah. So we bless God on tonight. I'm so grateful unto the Lord. I thank God to see Apostle and Overseer. Praise the Lord, Dr. Shelly. Amen. Yeah. Thank God. Amen. For the prayers that has gone up. Thank yeah. God my God has blessed his people. Those in the educational uh, skill. Yeah. I praise God so much, truly. Praise the Lord. We may look and see, praise the Lord, that it triggered down, praise the Lord, from the head. Praise the Lord. And we know that Apostle Shelley, praise the Lord, is an educated, yeah. uh, yes. a, a man of God. Amen. And I heard him say, if you desire to go back to school, well, Apostle Shelley, this year, this 2024, I'm thinking about going back to school. Praise Do the it. Lord. So Do I bless it. God and I praise God for uh, 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 your wisdom you. and your knowledge of thank God. You. I thank, thank God. God for Overseer Shelley. Praise the Lord. Down through the years, praise the Lord. Yes. She has planned nothing but a blessing to me Amen. and my family. I glorify and I magnify the name of the Lord for such two beautiful, beautiful, wonderful, loving apostles. Yes. And I thank God for you so much. Amen. And we pray for each and every one of you, praise the Lord, that have called in, praise the Lord, and asked them for prayer. We thank God for our uh, missionary Rolex, praise the Lord. We thank yes. God for everybody, everybody that's on tonight. Asking you all that know the words of prayer, continue to pray for us. Truly, the Lord is blessing us. Yeah. He is making ways. He is opening doors. And I thank God for it. I give God all glory, all honor, and all the praise that due to his name. Amen. God bless you all. We love you with the love of Jesus Christ. God bless. Amen. 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 Such a beautiful salutation. Thank God bless you, Deacon. Happy New Year Happy to Year. you and to yeah. Pastor. Amen. We praise, we praise God for you. We're going into a new year. Who thought, who thought <laughs> that we would be able to be on this side? God is good. Yes, he God is. is wonderful. He didn't have to do it, but he did. But he did. But he did. Praise did. the Lord. But now it's coming to a time we're close. We're very close to that hour that we would greet one another. We're very close. So we're going to hear from our overseer, uh, Apostle Margaret Shelley. Yes. Amen. Yes. We're going to hear from her, and she's going to, amen, give us a word, praise the Lord, and expound as we um, go into this new year. God bless you. Yes. Amen. I thank God so much for each and every one of you, amen, that's on the Zoom, that's on Facebook, that's on YouTube, the different social medias. I thank God so much for everyone. Protocol has already been set in place. And I thank God so much for my husband, yes. Apostle Dr. Shelley. I thank God for him and the wisdom that God yes, has Jesus. given unto him. Amen. I, I, I thank God for the people of God, for Holy Temple East, and I thank God so much for you all, amen, who stuck with us throughout the year of 2023, amen. 
I thank God so much for you. Amen. Because you didn't have to, but you did. And I, yes. I thank God so much. You know, I thank God so much for uh, these three special women, Prophetess Lucas, our uh, youth pastor, uh, Bedford, and our junior youth pastor, uh, Bell. Amen. They, they preach such a powerful word on this morning for the youth service. And I, I tell you, it was really powerful. And I, I tell you, uh, the word that, that mostly sticks out to me is our prophet is Lucas, shucking and jiving. Oh. <laughs> Amen. It was, yes. so, it was so powerful. But yes, she was saying, help Lord. You know, and I, I thank God how she said that she couldn't get away from that. And I've been seeking God and asking God, you know, to uh, give me what to, to give um, to the people uh, for the incoming year. Amen. And I tried to get away from the help, Lord, but God let me know that you know, people still need help. Amen. People Amen. still need help. You know, uh, I was in a situation on this weekend, and I began to call on God, and I asked God for his help, and, and God sent on help. Amen. God helped us. He Amen. gave, us, he gave us his help uh, on, uh, on this weekend, and you know, I'll forever give God who is to holy praise. to praise. Amen. Amen. For what he done and how he brought us out. And we're getting ready. Amen. We're a couple of minutes from the New Year's. And, and I know that God is going to continue. Amen. To give us his help. You know, I thank God for our uh, late uh Mother Robinson, who left us on this year, but, you know, she'll always be remembered in my heart. We'll always remember her. You know, one time pastor said that they wasn't late, they early. She made it before we did, you know, and I thank God, amen, 95 years old and how she she just um, she just was an inspiration to so many lives. She had a smile, amen, on her, amen, and and that smile by itself was such an anointing, mm -hmm. amen. amen. We got we got thirty seconds left, and we're getting ready to go into the New Year's. Amen. Hallelujah. God, we want everyone, amen, wherever you are, we want to welcome you, everyone, if you're on Facebook, Five, if four, you're on YouTube, three, two, if you're on Zoom, one.
Amen. We want you to give us another minute. Please don't leave us yet. Amen. But we want everyone that will. Every Amen. Everybody's gone. No, please. We want everyone that will to uh, plant a seed your first year 